Eight. Our Jenna Cisneros joins us live in the newsroom with more on McCain's time here in the Midlands. Jenna. Emily, well, not only nationally, people are mourning his loss right here in the Midlands. Tonight, I spoke with a 21-year uh, Army vet who served many years in Iraq and Kuwait, and he wanted to share his respect for Senator McCain's service tonight. Now, McCain uh, started fighting for our country long before entering the halls of Congress. McCain served in the Vietnam War. He survived being shot down and captured as a prisoner of war for nearly six years. He later made his transition into politics. McCain was elected into the U.S. House of Representatives from Arizona in 1982 and was elected to the United States Senate in 1986. And if you remember back in 2008, as McCain made his presidential bid, he made a stop right here in South Carolina. The presumptive Republican presidential nominee held a news conference and a fundraiser in the state that provided a key primary victory for him. In the presidential race, McCain won South Carolina in January of 2008, but ultimately lost the election to Barack Obama. Tonight, many Americans and those again right here in the Midlands are mourning the loss of a man who served 60 years for our country. And to have lost such a, a patriot to our country is really, I, I just feel as though it's, it's a loss for the country. As a loss for everyone who knew him. I, I, my sympathy and my, my heartfelt condolences go out to his family because they're the one that's feeling it the most. But the greatest loss is really to the country because we lost a true patriot today. And with a heavy heart, Terry a Budget says to celebrate him as he lived what he did for our country ultimately to make this a better place. Emily. Thanks for that, Jenna.